Hey boys, it's Harm9. Today, we're going to be talking about the new weapon that has been added into Grand Theft Auto Online. We're also going to be testing it. I've got my buddy Twingo here. Oh, there you are, up there on the hedge. Um, we're going to be seeing how much it costs. It is available at the gun van only, not at ammunition. Uh, so anyways, we're going to go in here and go to the weapons. The battle rifle costs $447,500. That is automatically ridiculous, I think. Would you agree, Twingo? Absolutely ridiculous. That is a lot of money. Okay, we're gonna buy it. The ex okay, okay, okay. Before what? It's got 20 rounds in a mag? Wait a minute, hang on, hang on. Let me turn on my HUD here. I need, I need to see this garbage, if, if that's true. Does it actually only have 20 rounds in a mag? It does. Oh, and the... F Oh, I don't like that. The fire rate is different. Like, it sounds different than how fast the bullets are actually shooting. I feel like. Uh, let me throw on the extended clip here. 51 grand. And how... Okay, all right. And I guess I'll put the suppressor on, too. I don't know. It nerfs, it nerfs the range a little bit, but it definitely looks a little cooler. So I'll throw that on. So... That's, that's, I think that's 500,000, no, 550 that I've paid for this thing now with the extended clip and the suppressor on it. This thing better be damn good. Um, now with the suppressor on it does have, it only has 30 rounds with the extended clip? Ridiculous. For, for 50 grand? Bro. Oh my God. Okay. I, I swear to God, every time they add a gun to GTA, it's a scam. Every single time. Okay. Well... Okay, Twinger, can I use you as a test dummy here? Do I have a choice? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use the Assault Rifle Mark II. Do you, you don't have body armor on or anything, do you? No. Okay. We're gonna do, actually, can we do this test? Let, let's do this like legit. I want you to stand on this yellow line in the parking lot. Like just right, right, right here where I'm standing. All right, okay. I'm gonna stand right here in the back of your car, okay? And I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot you right under the S on your Fister hoodie uh, with the Assault Rifle Mark II with a suppressor on it and a heavy barrel. And we're going to see how many shots uh, you can take. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you can take nine shots, okay. All right, and then if I can just get you to come back and stand on that same yellow line. Okay, now this is with the new battle rifle. I'm going to shoot you in the, sa in the same spot. You took nine shots from the other gun. Let's see how many you take from this. Two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it's the exact same as the assault rifle Mark II. The exact Ooh. same. That's pretty bad. Like for 550k, that's pretty trash. I wonder. I wonder about at range. Could you could you potentially stand on the other side of the street, right right on the uh, the sidewalk there? Yeah. There we go. Okay. That's that's perfect. Okay. Let let's. Let's test with the Assault Rifle Mark II again. I'm gonna keep shooting you right in the center of your chest. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so it's still nine from that distance. Okay, and then can I get you to come back again? <laughs> Please go subscribe to Twingo for his pain and suffering that I'm inflicting on him for this video. Okay, so it was nine shots with the Assault Rifle Mark II. Let's see if I can do this again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I feel like it shot twice. Like I saw your health jump, like what would have been like two bullets worth right there. I don't know how you possibly die in less bullets at that distance than you did from here. That would be weird. That you have the same amount of bullets in uh, your magazine? I had eight. Yeah, I, I, I had shot eight. That is weird. Do you want to stand there again one more time? Let's, I'm sorry. Let's do that one more time. That's very strange that it would be more damage. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I thought it was okay. gonna be 10. I thought it was gonna be 10, man. Okay, so it does the exact same amount of damage as the Assault Rifle Mark II, both with the suppressor, except this thing has 30 rounds in a mag, whereas the Assault Rifle Mark II, I mean, I do have a default clip on it, but I could put an extendo on it. They would give it 60 rounds. And it would probably be cheaper, honestly. I wonder about like a regular gun. 
Like maybe the advanced rifle. I wonder. I wonder how it would uh, how it would fare. Try it. Let's try it. Let's give it a shot. Okay. Advanced rifle with the suppressor again. So same same sort of thing. Uh, let's see how this does. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, 10 with this one. Okay, so Whoa. for your 550k, it, do, it does do a little more damage than the advanced rifle, which I believe is like a $30,000 rifle. You kind of have to make your choice if you would rather save like 500 grand for one extra bullet or not. I, I, I don't quite know that it's worth it. I, I don't know, for 550, man? And you can't even, get, much money. can't even get it at ammunition either. You have to get it from the gun van too, which there is a 10% discount allegedly, but still... That's crazy though, a 10% discount? And it's still 550 for everything? It doesn't even come with a scope either. Just no, yeah, it has no scope options either. That's another really good point. The iron sights, I will say, are very nice, but I don't know anyone who actually uses the iron sight, or to be fair, who uses a scope in reality. Like, I, I don't really know anyone who does that. So, I don't know, it's just, it just seems like a weird weapon. Like, I, I, I wanna like it, but 550 grand, I can't help but feel like they're they're just trying to rip people off like that's kind of criminal i don't know it's it does look cool but it doesn't it, def, it definitely doesn't look cooler than something like the service carbine or the heavy rifle for that matter or the military rifle either like i'd say it looks about even with all of them and it's got le it doesn't have a grip so your recoil is going to be a little bit worse the fire rate is also garbage bro okay wait i have a, i have a little test we can do here you use that i'm gonna use the assault rifle mark ii let's start shooting each other in like middle of the chest at the same time and see who dies first a lot of full auto yeah Sp all right when the grenade goes off let's do it when the grenade goes off if you can if you can throw that and and all right all right Oh, oh, I think I hit a headshot. <laughs> <I think laughs> <it's a> headshot. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Maybe we should shoot more like lower, like like in the in the like tummy. So uh, yeah, so so so, so, so the away. yeah, and so the recoil doesn't go up and hit a headshot by accident. All right, grenades going to the left. All right, all right, I'm ready. To your right. We die oh. at the same time. Okay, all right, all right. I I can't hate on it too hard, honestly. Like. I don't know, it, but the thing is, it's the same as the Assault Rifle Mark II, and the Assault Rifle Mark II, I don't know, I can't remember for the life of me what an Assault Rifle Mark II costs at the MOC. It's been so long since I bought it, but I feel like there's no way that it's 550 grand, right? Like, it can't be. I think maybe like 180. Yeah, I feel like, there, like a, I feel like it is like, I feel like it is like 180. Yeah. All right, so the Assault Rifle Mark II costs 98,750 for the conversion at the Weapon Workshop. So about a hundred thousand dollars, which that's that's pretty reasonable, I would say. And that's on top of purchasing it. Of course, with the Mark II variant, though, we got to keep in mind we can get the special ammo types with it too, which is pretty huge. That's that's a big advantage. And also the extended clip on it, which gives you sixty rounds instead of thirty, costs twenty one thousand dollars, which is kind of insane. It also has a foregrip, which is 14,000, a flashlight, which is 10,000, and three different scopes, which you can get, which range from 19,000 to 34,000, and muzzles that range from 40 grand to 29 grand. And then it does have the heavy barrel attachment, which is another 50. And you can put liveries on it still. I feel like the Assault Rifle Mark II like, is a much better deal for, for what you're getting. And I think you're gonna save a lot of money too. And arguably, I think it looks way cooler too. So I don't know. Do with this information what you will, guys. I don't know. Twingo, what do you think? What, what, what would you recommend? The battle rifle is such an underperformer for how much it costs. It is not worth your time. Yeah, I, I I completely agree. I don't know. With our very limited testing, that's definitely the conclusion I'm coming to. Unless there's some piece of the puzzle that maybe we're missing, but I have a sneaking suspicion that we've got the whole puzzle and uh, and we've figured out that they're trying to scam you. So. Don't buy the battle rifle unless you hear otherwise. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed or if you found this useful. We gotta spread the word around of the community. We don't want a bunch of people wasting 550 grand on this hot garbage rifle. Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new. Subscribe to Twingo for helping me out and being my test dummy for this video. We'll see you in the next one. Till then, take care. Hey, yikes.